Hi, thanks for coming. I'm going to show you how to pack your kit so when you go out to do your appointments it's all organized and ready. And so, um, here we go. Take everything out of your kit and then this is how I repack it, okay? And anything that I don't talk about here, it doesn't go with me when I'm doing appointments. The first thing is a satin hands kit. They just changed satin hands so mine looks different but when this is done I'll be putting the regular satin hands in there. So that needs to go in there. I have a money bag. So this could be uh, just uh, go to a dollar store and buy a oh, sorry. pencil kit. I have calculators. I carry four of them actually in here. I have my money, my float, and my float is $30 in like toonies and loonies. I have my pens in here, and this is where I put all my money until it goes to the bank. So this is called my money bag, and that's how I load it up. I have a cloth for cleaning my mirrors. I have a roll of uh, garbage bags. I choose to put all my products and I organize it in one roll up. You would buy this from Mary Kay Empty. I put my cleanser moisturizers here. I put my day night solution here. I put my CC creams here. I put my eye makeup remover, my lip glosses, and my mascara wands, my sponge tip applicators. They are all in here. And I keep it this. Why I love this bag is because it's got a handle. And if I'm just going to do a face, I take this bag out and a mirror and I don't take my whole bag I take my money bag as well okay so I set all my product up in a roll up I suggest you do the same because it keeps you on track because everything's in the sequence that we use it if you don't then you can leave it in a ziploc bag don't put it in the you can uh, use a ziploc bag don't just put your products loose in here it'll muck that up, it'll get dirty, something will leak, I promise you something will leak. Okay, I need to carry my customer profiles, so I put them down the side, I don't put them in my, this, this lifts out, so I put them in the side of the lift out, I put my, write my sales tickets up on the side of the lift out, there is a video on how to fill out a customer profile, there is a video on how to fill out a customer receipt. I have my disposable face cloths. I pack them down the center here. My mirrors are on this side. There's a little divider here. I put my mirrors on this side. And I carry all my little cotton balls, cotton puffs, stir sticks, everything like that in one of my mirrored bags. I take my mirrors out. I do not leave them wrapped up in the little bags, not necessary. And on the far side, whoops, I have my handout that I use to teach about skin care. I have the handout on the instructions and the what do you get free. I have that for the time wise. I have it for the volume firm. And I have my plastic, I put this in a plastic uh, sleeve, how to uh, do your color instructions. So I have those, one for one set for each person that's going to be there. I have my sticky pads in case I have to write a note on something. And that's what I carry in my kit. So I load it up. Oh yes, I have these, but I'm not, I'm not usually having to uh, replace these every time because I go to the sink and have them try their product on and I let them try it on the back of their hand by passing them the product and we just do it right at the table. Oh, the other thing that should be in here that's not in here is my, but I have some in here, are my bounty paper towels. And I use bounty paper towel for the back of the hand and all sorts of things, so I wouldn't go anywhere without my bounty. So, how this all packs up, everything fits in there quite nicely. My satin hands 
The new satin hands fits in there perfectly. You can pull it together. Whoops, got to put my cloth in. I just use a micro cloth. Put that in, zipper it up, and I've got everything ready to roll to go to an appointment. So I take this, whoops, that's shaky, I'm sorry. Um, I take this to my appointments. Okay, if I'm working with the hostess, I have my hostess uh, colors in here. So my color cards are in here. My disposable liners. I, I don't want to unpack that, so I'm just going to show you what I've got here. I, I've got my color cards marked for CC creams instead of the eye colors. I've got those in here. I've got my disposable liners in here. I happen to have a little thing that holds them, which is great. You can just let them go loose. So I have my deep brown eyeliners, my light nude lip liners. I put those all in there. And everything else is in my bottom fourth layer. So this, I just use one of these bags to put my color cards and everything in for the hostess. And then I just keep that on the side here. And so when I'm working with the hostess, I pull that out. Otherwise, nobody ever knows that I have that color with me. Why? Because if you get into color, you have gone down the rabbit hole. <laughs> okay, so that's what I take to my appointment. That's how my kit is packed. I'm ready to roll. And uh, I often, if I'm just going to do a one-on-one -on -one with somebody, I don't necessarily always take my kit. However, you can take your kit. <laughs> and I just take my roll-up and go because I have everything sort of in there too. But, I will tell you, I have gotten to appointments where I didn't have an applicator, so I had to invent how I was going to do things. So, I suggest you take your kit. Good practices. Don't do bad practices. Okay, so that's how you pack that up. Everything we didn't talk about, you're leaving in the box, and when we need it, we'll go find it. Okay, that should be uh, just a real quick thing. You might probably have to watch it a couple times to see exactly how I pack it, but that's how I pack it, that's what I take to appointments. Thanks, great, bye for now. And my roll of garbage bags was on this side, and I bought that at the Dollarama too. Okay, thanks, bye.